new video. I'm on the sat nav, Tom's driving, and we're actually going to potentially get a new car. That's why I think I'm gonna focus this vlog element is the fact that I'm buying a new car. Very excited. Um, I think what we're doing today is just test driving though, but if I like it and all is well, then my name has already been put down for one, so hopefully I'm gonna like it because I'm fairly committed already. This car's going back in a couple of weeks. I am fairly committed. You don't have to have it. No, I know I don't have to have it, but we've been looking at this make and model for a while. It is a Mercedes, I mean, you know more about cars than me. What is it? It's an A-Class. A Mercedes? Yeah. A-Class. A220 AMG. In white, automatic. That's all I care about, really. Um, yeah, I'm such a girl. <laughs> So, uh, we are coming up to a right turn in about five minutes. And then I'm heading on to Manchester afterwards. I have an event with Look Fantastic and Philosophy. I believe they've collaborated on a beauty box. Yeah, this is, this is like Berry area, although Tom calls it Bury. <laughs> well, so you say it in your accent. Bury. Bury, or as I would say, Berry. I went to school in Berry, St Edmunds. Well, you're posh, we've gone through this already. No, I'm not posh, I'm just not northern northern. Posh, posh. I'm not posh. You go down south, they say I sound northern. Uptown girl. She's, She's been, been living, living in an uptown world. world. Well, I'm not uptown. Yeah, you're, you're definitely I have bloody love Primark charity shop and I am not uptown. I love a bargain. Uh, so that is the plan. That is the agenda for today. I'm super excited. Ah! I'm wearing my new Topshop coat, which is just divine. It's like a teddy. I thought you were coming in for a nestle then. No. What are you sniffing? Some water. Oh, there's some water down here. I'll give it to you in a sec. And then this t-shirt is Topshop. I've got my new leather pants on front which i picked up from primark actually they're a really good fit they're not leather they're like a uh waxed jean and then i have some boots on which are like boots. yeah western cowboy style from fourth reckless that is the worst outfit of the day but it's an outfit of the day nonetheless Tom just said we can get two, look, we can get this one. I like the look of that one, actually. You want that one? Is that the one that we're looking at for me, then, this red one, but in white? Oh, it smells fresh and new, doesn't it? Do you like this? It's cool, isn't it? Yeah. So what's this one? This is a GLE. This is the inside of the one we're looking at, and this is a, this is the hatchback, isn't it? Yeah. Which is the one that I would want, but automatic, not manual, just because I prefer automatic. And it's not too much, it's not too different in price, is it? Yeah. Is uh, it? Uh, no. I feel like for me it's worth a little bit of extra money because I just I like the convenience of an yeah, automatic. It'll feel bigger because you'll have a glass roof on yours. A glass roof? Mm. Yeah, panoramic roof, yeah. Like a black? A black glass roof, yeah. Mm. Yeah, I was saying it feels a little bit like more sporty than the one I, well obviously the one I've got is just standard. No, I, I get that. <laughs> Tom's been playing around, we found ambient lighting. It's cool though, isn't it? Oh look, it's like a touch pad. Oh, that's red weird. Here. Red here. Yeah, I don't like the red. Is it all, are they all got red in? No, you watch. I just want the white one. Oh wait, what are we looking at that's red? Yeah. Oh, the actual, come on. Whoa! <laughs> this is the one. Well, not that exact car potentially, but make a model. I am a fan. Like Sold. It. Yeah, I like it's it. A good one. Yeah, I like it. Yeah! So I'll probably have the new car within the next couple of weeks, hopefully. Fingers crossed. No! as soon as I got the camera out. We've got 15 minutes before I need to get to the event. So considering Lydia isn't coming with me today. Mm. Are you free to take a quick outfit picture? I wanna show off my new Topshop coat on my Instagram. Instagram husband in the back. I started drawing a wage. You start drawing a wage? I No, I said you start it. If you want to, what's mine is your baby. Get a joint bank account. Yeah, easy. I don't know if I like the idea of that. A bit self, no, not self 
selfish when it comes to money. I'm tight. I like to save money. So hence, getting a car is a big deal for me. Look at all that pampas grass. Is that what you were saying? Oh. Cut them down. Uh, so we're heading on into Manchester now to, like I was saying, Thomas. But it is, yeah. Oh, I know where we are. McDonald's. This, yes, we usually come in from that side. Oh, oh this isn't that rough. This area. No. I, I used to live in this area. Lower Broughton. I um, was just saying I had a bit of a breakout on my forehead at the minute, and I don't know why. I've been trying out some new products, and I sometimes feel like when you try out new things, it's almost a bit harsher on your skin, and you're better off just sticking to what you know, which for me is just micellar water cleanse with my foreo and a cleanser which i like the alamis one tone moisturize that's it Boom. cleanse tone moisturize simple and i feel like you don't even need an exfoliation with that because the the foreo brush gets in deep anyway i am hungry deep. look at that what christmas has reached the end oh, they've got new trees right where do we get, yeah, but they're the potted ones. You can get them from B&Q now. Oh, well, we you, don't, you don't want that. We don't want a potted one. We want one that's been cut down. We're in. There's a space there, there's a space. Oh, no, the <gasps> next one up is a good one for the House of Freedom. Really. Okay, actually. Oh, look, there's space there. No, that's tight. It's so tight, this car park is, oh, struggling with this ticket Like a yeah. good pair of leather leggings. <laughs> You've been going up the wrong up. That's the wrong up. I know, I've realised this is the wrong up. Well, what are you doing? We're not allowed up here. We're still going up there. Oh, God, we could have been hit. By who? A car. God. Ah. Oh. Calm down. <laughs> Pisces, calm down. There's space there. Are you getting in that? You're all reversing in it. Oh, my God, we're back up in again. Okay, now we've gone past about 10 spaces here. Where are you going? You're man here. Yeah, he's going, isn't he? Oh, and you've gone for a tight space that's Perfect. tighter than the other one. Keep going. Yeah, you might not like it. Perfect. You're not... That. He's got to get past you. Oh, yeah. So just keep going. There'll be spaces there. There's no spaces there, bro. <laughs> Loads of spaces up there. No. Look, one right there. Can you see it? Shh. It's the right... It's right by the oh, lift, though. Just be quiet. <laughs> for God's sake. Like a little kid. Yeah, yeah. Space, 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 no, space, not space, just, space, space. You just, you're on a different mind wavelength to me sometimes. Good. I'm glad I am. I know. I'm glad I'm not you. <laughs> These boots are made for walking. They are so <laughs> which I'll talk you through a little bit more in a minute because it kind of goes back to the actual backstory of how the brand started. Um, but yeah, we're all about looking good. Women. 
in. We're checking who's adorable. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry. But everyone's looking at me. And we've got, I think we've got icing and stuff. Yeah. Yeah. So we're going to decorate our little gingerbread women and see how it turns out. I think I'm going to do like this little dress but in a red version and then where it's red I'll put white or little beads or something. Oh actually that top one's a red dress. I'm gonna try and copy that. Show the vlog. <laughs> I've got a drunk gingerbread lady. A drunk, a drunk, I can't even speak. I should have the drunk gingerbread lady. That's basically me. No, and then know. I'm trying to copy this, but I've got a little bow going on and a dress. That's quite natural. Um, not so sure, but we're getting there. Not giving up my day job. No, not anytime soon. Oh look, and I've got one of my hairs in it as well. That's just not <laughs> ideal. Oh, health and safety. Well, at least it's yours. I hope it's mine. Oh no! There we go. Lovely. We're doing a little hot chocolate station here with Bailey. My fave, I love Bailey's. Just like that, we're back home. I've just noticed you've left that light on in that wardrobe. Which light on? Just turned it on now. Oh, have you? Go on then, let's see what you've bought. Nice though, aren't they? Hang on a minute, is that? Cotton. 100% cotton. Oh, XL. Eight quid. Prime Arnie. It feels nice. So that's like a forest green, I would say. Mm. Now, that's one size, right? That's XL. What, have you bought an L? Yeah. I think that one looks fine though. Look at the arm length. You're always going to struggle with that, aren't you? the right one, isn't it? There's not much in it. It's not a lot. To be it? fair. I think both fit fine. Yeah, the XL. Yeah. Just for a bit more room. More there, because... Because, you know, gains. Hashtag bulking. Bulking? Isn't that what it is? Bulking and shredding? Bulking, not sulking. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you think... I think so. Who do you think? I think the green one. My mum says that. You know, if you mishear someone, instead of going, what? She'll go, who? Who? Just like you just said. Who do you prefer? Now, I don't know if they go together, I'll be just honest. Trying, just trying, <laughs> oh, God, it's only five o'clock and um, it feels later because it's got dark so easily. So early. So early. There's a guy with ten of them in his hand. Yeah, he says you were buying them for something. He says they sell out. Really? Honestly, yeah. Well, I suppose because Primark aren't online. He was buying them for something. Eight quid for that, I can't believe it. Don't do that, though. What? For the sake of potentially getting two quid a shirt. I think I'm going to do that. Can't be bothered with that. Definitely not. You'd, you'd say, suggest for me to do it. Nice. That's, see, that's a different colour to anything you own. Already, that's more of a shacket. Well, no, it's a shirt, isn't it? But it's corduroy that one versus the cotton. You feeling yourself? Oh yeah. Feeling yourself. Anyway, like I said, we have just got back home. I don't think my gingerbread lady made it very well, but it's gonna taste the same, I'm sure. What should we have for dinner? <gasps> Look at what I've done. I wasn't even wearing that much makeup. Oh no, see that's the problem with having a cream coat. <sighs> so, look fantastic and philosophy have collaborated, as I'm sure you could tell from the event. They gifted us the collaboration box and also put it in this cute little silver bag, like travel bag for us. Uh -huh. 
lovely. If they're still available, be quick. Just a brief overview because you did kind of see all the uh, things at the event. Cute little philosophy travel pouch. And then this was my favorite product, the Gingerbread Man. This smells incredible. So I didn't realize, but Philosophy is a huge American brand. So things like this is just, it's them all over, isn't it? So that is a nice whipped body souffle that smells amazing. It's not too sweet, which I really like because it's got citrus running through it. And then we have the cleanser. I'm really excited to try that. You can use it for your makeup brushes as well, but I feel like I'm gonna just save that for my face. And then this is the Renewed Hope in a Jar, that's a nice moisturiser, which we mixed with the vitamin C powder, 99.8% vitamin C, so pretty much pure vitamin C. Line correcting eye cream, and then a pore extractor mask. I feel like you might like this one, Tom. It's one of those clay masks that kind of tightens, and then as you rub it off, it's got little fine exfoliating beads in it, so. Lovely. Yay! And it smells pretty good, too. Hair up, make puff, and enjoy dinner whilst watching I'm a Celebrity. Get me out of here. <laughs> got my bubble hat, got my cozy faux fur coat on, purse, phone, camera, turn all the lights off. And we are heading off to a place called Heaton Park in Manchester. If you're from the area, you'll know it. It's a pretty big park where they hold Park Life Festival and there's a festival called Lightopia Festival which has come to Manchester and I believe it's here until the end of December. Are you ready? So we get to go and see it. It opens to the public tomorrow. Uh, by the time you're watching this it'll already be open. Um, so we are going down to see what it's like, what it's all about. I believe it's some kind of a display of different lights. So let's go this is my cozy outfit of choice got my little bobble hat there OTTD OOTD it's OOTD I've got this coat from Nasty Girl which is literally the thickest coziest coat I own so it's pretty cold outside hence why I've got this on tonight this hoodie from Misguided underneath here um, a t-shirt just from Everlane I'll probably just tuck that in or whatever um, Primark leggings, but I've also got Topshop tights on underneath this. They're like legging tights, uh, just as like thermals. So I've put them on underneath. And then I have my new, I've got these new boots from Primark, which are not intended to get muddy, but if they do, it doesn't really matter. I thought I'd go with these instead of wellies because it's the first night. I'm not sure if it's like a guided walk where it'll be super, super clean or if it's going to be a bit muddy, I don't know. So we've gone with a boot that if it gets trashed, it doesn't matter, and hoping that they don't. <laughs> and Tommy's OOTD. That's me. Oh. Oh, you're tired. What, Paul? You're not ready for this. <sighs> oh, yeah, I can't wait. You just did a big yawn. Yeah, you know, that's contagious. You know why it's contagious. Yeah, okay. Well, I think... I think it might be by looks, but... It might be. But I heard that a yawn is contagious because you, like feel starved of oxygen for the person next to you who's yawning so you feel like you too need to go <sighs> how many of you just yawned <laughs> oh where are we going where are we going I wonder when the year of the rat is. Well, I think it might be 2020. Oh yeah. <laughs> I just spotted that. Well, do you know your animal? Oh wow. It will be. Do you know that one there? One's a monkey. No. Do you know what that reminds me of? Not real, is it? Yeah. Do you know what it reminds me of, Tom? Where was it we went? Oh, in Barbados. What happened in Barbados? Do you remember in Barbados when we hired the car and we went driving around and on the top oh, of a hill there was yeah, a yeah, yeah, cool, monument like that? Oh look Tinkerbell! Let's spin like around. It. It's hard to see because of the light obviously. It's so pretty! Do you want? 
back one. Old wine, I might get old wine. So, ladies and gentlemen, good evening and welcome to the official launch of Lightopia Festival. 2,000 individual lanterns and over a million light bulbs. And Lightopia officially opens to the public tomorrow and will run through till the 31st of December. Five, four, three, two, one! What about that? A massive round of applause. It is officially open, the Lightopia Festival! Larry the leopard. And then over there we've got a little family of giraffes. That's so cute. Tommy the tiger. Tommy the tiger. You can't even see you. This section I think is definitely the best, but I am an animal lover. And then there's the rhino. Robert the rhino, Tommy. And Roger. Let's go see Roger. And we've got Zoe the zebra. Are we done? And Zara the zebra. Oh, Tom's done. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, we're done. We're done now. Time for home. Hello. This isn't the start of a new vlog. I had panicked then. I had a bit of a mind blank of where I was, what I was doing, who I'm to, talking to, where I'm. Where. This morning we were up bright and early and just been getting on with some work and stuff. And I've just had a shower, wash my hair. Got dressed and ready to set off to Manchester because I am back there today with the Mean Fragrance, which is one of my favourites. I'm wearing one now called Green Pearl, and we have another one called Nasak or Nasak. Amazing. So I'm going to afternoon tea with them at Cloud 23, which is at the Hilton Hotel, which is so nice of them to have invited us. Before that, I need to run a couple of errands, need to head to the post office, ship off Mr. Carrington's parcel for our thrift. Christmas gift swap video that we're doing very soon. Let's fill up with fuel, grab a bite to eat for the road, and I'll see you guys when I get to Manchester. It's situational. If they yeah. cheat on you, then yeah, yeah the, the, the trust is probably never going to come back, and it's probably. He sees you when you're sleeping. He knows when you're. 
we're getting in the festival. Oh, we'd rather not get copyrighted for our Oh, amazing God, singer. our amazing voices. I'm with Lydia. We are just going to head down and shoot an outfit before heading on to the event. With the mean, which I'm so excited. I even spritzed a bit of the mean on this morning. Do you I have any the mean? Oh, I say the mean. It's a TH. I know, but I feel like when I spoke. Um, it's very blue. It is very blue, isn't it? We were having this conversation. Did you used to pose with an arm like that when you were oh, yeah. nights out? Oh, yeah. Oh, we're here. No, we're not. Oh, no, we're not. <laughs> We are back, I was gonna say back home, back to Lydia's, just vlogging, <laughs> just vlogging. <laughs> Lydia's lit the candles for us, very nice and cozy and it's timed this event that, I don't know, I just did a little squat there. Let's hope, see what time it is. Oh, it is six o'clock already. I'll stay here for a bit. Um, rush hour the, the event finished at half five so i wasn't that keen to set off super quick and then be stuck in rush hour for two hours so um i thought i would just quickly come on here and show you what we got at thamine so thamine is a fragrance that i know and love and have talked about in last year's gift guide that's the only reason why i didn't include it would you like a drink um just a water please just a water Oh, sorry, I didn't. I thought you'd I forgotten say, about it. No, I, didn't say it. It's I thought you were talking to me earlier, but I wasn't sure if it was that or not. Anyway, uh, I'm fine without, to be honest. Oh, I'm not fussy. <gasps> These leather leggings, guys. Sitting on the floor. Yeah, I do quite like sitting on the floor. Yeah, I find it grounding. <laughs> Yeah, literally. Yeah, I do. We what? have we have our sofa in the lounge, and then we have like a bean bag, and I like to sit on the bean bag on the floor. Oh, you're weird. Yeah. Um. So it improves my flexibility. Oh, I guess because you're sat on the floor. Anyway, these leggings now come in burgundy and khaki. They're the amazing Topshop ones that I love. Get them, guys. Yeah, I'm tempted to get the khaki ones. I think burgundy is just a little bit too colourful for me. You're kind of convincing me to get them. What's better than the... Are they better than the Zara ones and why? So much better than why? Zara ones. Because Zara lose the shape a little yeah, bit. They're a bit baggy good in the crotch point. or they get a bit big around the waist. Yeah. Honestly, and, and they've got this lining on the inside that's like fleecy. They're oh, so comfy. Yeah. Um, yeah, I really, really like them. So we'll leave them linked. But yeah, burgundy, nice for the festive season, and then khaki. Anyway, the fragrance that I picked out, we got to smell a load of different fragrances that they had on offer tonight and i went for this one which is a collaboration they did with rolls royce she's all cozy i'm so jealous don't mind that she's me. home already don't mind me in my dressing as easy as that you look cozy though <laughs> um yeah. so the the main reason i was torn between this one and another one which was like an oody scent loved it um it was a little more masculine oh i've just gone out of focus and we're back. So I went for the Regent Leather 50 mil, and this is a special edition box that they did a collaboration with Rolls Royce on, so I think Tom will appreciate that. It's his favorite fragrance is The Mean. Um, so yeah, thank you to The Mean for having us for afternoon tea. We did miss out on an spa event that was being held today as a result of the The Mean event, uh, but because we went to the S bar one last week, which I'll have done in last week's vlog, we thought we'd change it up with Thamine and oh, they are a really, really good brand and it's something a bit different. So yeah, S bar has said to us we can go for another spa day another time, which is always very nice. We should book it. Yeah, 
we should. Do you know what I think you should do with those candlesticks? Chop one of the candles down so they're different heights. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, but they burn out quite quickly. That's the only thing. Or just light one for a bit then. <laughs> Like one and not the other. Yeah. Oh, you've got the winter candle as well. This is my favourite white company scent. I'm trying to save it. I was going to say save it. A candle. <laughs> I know. So it's just special occasion, but I'll probably buy another one. And often they do like um, Black Friday discount. So well, yeah, they start doing more sales in the lead up to Christmas as well. Do. And then after Christmas, they always have loads of and sales. It's usually, so those are about, those are £20 and a lot of the time they go down to about 16 60. Yeah, something yeah. like that, 20% off. Yeah. So 16 They always seem to do like the, I know I'm literally like squatting, squatting here. What's they always seem it? to do the, um, <laughs> the like festive scents at like 20% off but then after Christmas they get like 30-40% off so it's worth stocking up I think I might do that this year it's always just once Christmas is gone you then don't want to buy yeah I know I suppose winter in January it's alright anyway I'm actually going to sign off this vlog here. Do you want to end it for me? Yeah, thank you so much for watching Freya's vlog. Um, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. She'd really appreciate it if you did. And also go and follow her on Instagram. Her handle I is... You plug yourself then. You oh, can yeah. Do. Go follow me. <laughs> uh, her handle is at Freya Farrington 1. Yeah. Or... Very, very, very. Oh no, <laughs> let me get there. Freya, Freya, Freya. Let me get there. You got there before me. Um, yeah, Freya found in home and yeah. Go and, and follow Lydia me. And Jane Tomlinson. That's me. That's her. She needs to get a home account. Keep telling her. I know I'm going to. Are I you? Um, I'm definitely going to do it, but it's just going to be, I want it all done on my camera. So. Oh, nice. I'm going to take refresh. my time with it. Yeah, yeah just like a Lydia, for a different Elise vibe. Elise Millen style mm, like quite professional maybe. yeah i'll try yeah, anyway thanks for watching guys i hope you enjoyed it and i'll hope we've see done you again all this next time. <laughs> bye guys i always do a little kiss though don't i